Open services snap in by running services.msc command. In services snap in, ensure the application identity service is running. You can right click on this service and select start if it isn't running. You will have to launch the SecPal. You can do this by pressing WinR and enter secpal.msc and run dialog box to open the security policy snap-in, or from the Windows search button. Next, in the security policy snap-in window, navigate to security settings, application control policies, app locker then executable rules. Right-click on the executable rules, then select Create New Rule. On the Permissions tab, select Action Deny. Select the administrator accounts or users which you want to prevent turning off BitLocker. On the next section, select Publisher and click Next. Under Publisher, select Browse. Browse to see Windows then System32 and select Manage BDE.exe file. On the Exception tab, I will have to click Next as I do not want to add an exception. Under Name, provide a description and click Create. Here are the created rules to prevent administrators from turning off BitLocker. Close the security policy snap-in and run GP Update Force command to update machine policies on the client PC. Now let's test. Run Manage BDS status, you will see the program has been blocked. I hope you found this video on to prevent local admins from managing BitLocker with Manage BDE command useful. Please feel free to leave a comment below.